What's up, everybody? We are here at our Revolt and Xfinity event um, here in Atlanta, Georgia. I'm your host, Jayla Jackson, and your socialite. And I am here in the room with some black excellence. And right now, to my right, this is a producer, an actor, a filmmaker, a CEO of Walker Productions. Come on now. Come on. We, Come on, we know it. Like, you know, I'm not going to say introduction. <laughs> Please tell the people who you are and a little bit about yourself. My name is Etienne Maurice. Filmmaker, creator, yoga instructor. You know, I always like, sometimes I don't include that part, but I'm like, nah, that's important. I'm a Put yogi. It in there. I'm a yogi. I'm a yogi. So I'm just happy to be here. I'll be moderating uh, today's festivities. Uh, I'm going to be talking with some independent, upcoming filmmakers. Um, as well as a panel with a bunch of other special people mm -hmm. here, so I'm excited. So this event today, for you guys who don't know, it's an HBCU edition. So it's this emphasis on young black creators. Why do you feel that that emphasis is important? I think, you know, I'm a big believer in community, right? And I think a lot of people who are in attendance today, they need someone to aspire, to be inspired by, uh, but most importantly, to have someone who looks like you to be able to give you that inspiration, right? Because you can't can't be what you can't see. Right. right. And I think Revolt is an amazing job of representing underrepresented filmmakers and creatives and giving them a platform. So I'm just here to be with the community. That was a word. I don't know if y'all caught that. <laughs> that was a word. So I'm actually 17. Oh. Yeah. What? Yeah. And so one of my favorite. Y'all know she's 17. <laughs> <laughs> One of my favorite quotes is representation is the lens through which we learn. And that's so true. So as a young person, I want to give everybody here their flowers. Thank you. You are making an investment into something that's going to pay off so, you know, largely. So, and I'm inspired by you to be so young and to be here and asking these questions and really Thank holding you. your own. That's, that's no easy feat. Thank you so much. You're welcome. You're absolutely welcome. I want to ask you one more question. A lot of my, you know, followers and viewers are young people. You are an owner of a company. So there's this, you know, love for your art, and then there's this business side of it, which a lot of times it's hard to make that transition. Could you give some advice in that? How did you turn something in, that you love into a successful growing? I'll tell you right now, get your LLC or your S Corp or your C Corp or your nonprofit, right? So these are different classifications that you need in order for your business to be represented, right? Uh, I started with an S-Corp, um, you know, because I want to be able to grow my business and be able to diversify my shares in my business and stock. Um, and you can get an LLC, which is a limited liability uh, company, uh, which uh, a lot of people who are just now entering into the business space you can do that as well. Um, so now, Actually starting my own business I'm now learning what all this means right I did not know what any of this mean like two three years ago right um, but I say this to say if you don't know how to do something find somebody that does know until you learn on your own I learned that from, from Barry Gordy when he started Motown he didn't know how to start a record label but he was able he had some money saved up to start his own business and be able to hire people so that now he can grow this multi-billion dollar enterprise right so I encourage y'all to, to do the same and get yourself an accountant get yourself an accountant somebody who's good with money you know me I was never good with math but I knew how to hustle I knew how to grind and also had friends who were better at things than I was right so I think also the most important thing with starting your business is find other friends other people who are your peers that are just as talented just as passionate if not more passionate because they were going to believe in your dreams your aspirations yeah. and it's going to be way more fulfilling in the long run y'all heard it i mean that's gold advice like he is giving gems right now thank you guys so much for tuning in thank you so much for your words of wisdom it is so appreciated and i'm proud of you please tell the people where they can find you and how they can support and stay tuned uh, my name is Etienne Maurice. You can follow me at Walk Good Etienne. That's Walk Good Etienne. Uh, or follow my organization, Walk Good LA, Walk Good Productions, anything, everything, Walk Good. That's, that's what we're doing. Y'all heard it. Make sure y'all go support Walk Good. Thank you so much, and that's a wrap.